Hey, it's Zombie, and here is my long-awaited LA Girl Glazed Lip Paint swatch video. I have 12 of them, so this video might be just a little bit long. So I'm going to try and get through them, you know, pretty fast, so it's not like a 20-minute video or some shit. So I'm excited. I got these on Amazon. I'm going to leave the link below from where I got them. They came in six sets, and then I can't remember which ones were in which set. Everybody knows the original set. The original set that has Koi in it, this one, the set of six. Well, there was another set that was called Fall Set, like Fall Color Set. So I got that one too. And so I'm going to do like hand swatches. And then I'll either just have my lip swatches right here in your face or I'll have it up in the corner while I'm talking about it. So since I'm holding on to Koi, let's start with Koi. Koi is, and of course these are super intense color with extra glossy finish. Finish. Let me just watch it on my hand. I was actually, at first, when I first heard about these, I was like, mm, no, I don't think I really want to wear these because they sound like lip glosses and I was not down for the lip gloss stuff. But when I saw people putting them on, I thought they were just, and now I'll go for the next one, which is going to be Gleam, and it just looks like this. I'm going to put this on my hand, but I kept seeing people doing them in videos, and I kept seeing pictures of them on Instagram, and I was just like, I need this. I think I really need this, and so I went and looked for them online, and I found three sets. Now, the third set, I'm not too fond of. The third set, I did not order because it was pastels, and I was pretty sure they were going to look like lip glosses, and I don't want them to look like lip glosses. This third one I'm going for is Baby Doll. And this is a, well, I guess, ooh, it looks like it exploded. Damn it, that sucks. Hopefully it's savable, salvageable. Hopefully it didn't all explode. I mean, I just opened these up before this video, but let's swatch this. Oh, and it's a cute pink, too. I'm going to have to try and, like, save this stuff with a lip pencil or something. Ugh. That's kind of frustrating. Okay, so one out of the 12 is exploded. <laughs> the next one is Bombshell. And it just looks like this. There's a lot of pinks and a lot of purples in here. And I'm kind of excited about this. This one is not exploded, thank goodness. Oh, yeah. This is a bright-ass pink. This is a my style kind of pink. <sighs> Most people don't do dark pinks. It's this one. as an everyday pink, but I would. Trust me, I would. The next one is Seduce. Which I believe one of these purples is actually a dark reddish color. Because I started looking them up online and I was just like, I'm going to see what these look like. Because I, I mean, I'm excited about seeing them on my own hand because I'm like super pale and a lot of the people aren't as pale. This is a pretty purple. That's nice. Like, so I looked them up online and I was excited. I can't, I'm glad that I finally opened them up because I'm ready to freaking use them. This next one is called Tease, and this is what the tube looks like. And I have it upside down because the stickers are upside down on it. It's weird. Let's see what Tease looks like. I'm going to go on another level. Tease is another really, really nice pink. It. Why did I do that? It's like right there under the purple. They kind of smell like mint paint. <laughs> Like mint finger paints? I don't know. They, smell, they kind of remind me of my son's finger paints. Which is not a, really a bad thing. This next one is called Tempt. And that is super dark. Really, really dark. So I'm going to go right over next to that pink. Oh my god, this is like a freaking bloody vampire red. Check this out. It looks almost black on there. Let me just smear it out a little bit kind of like a, like I said, a bloody vampire red. That's so awesome. And I need a makeup wipe. So yeah, that is super pretty. The next one is Daring. It's another purplish one. I'm saying purplish because that last one looked like blood red, so. Uh, oh my goodness. I haven't seen the rest yet, but I have a feeling this one's going to be my favorite. This one is right here. Oh, I love it. I hope it shows up nice. Plus, the lip the lip videos are going to be over here, over here somewhere, which is cutting off my hand, most likely. 
This next one is a nice red, and it's called Pin Up, which I've seen this one all over the internet. And I like me a nice red, so let's go with this one. Pin oh, oh, yeah. That's kind of cute. I like this one. It's kind of a pinkish red. Like this one, this blood red is more red than this one. This one's kind of pink looking, which is not bad. I like it. And we have three more. We got another purplish one going on. This one is called Blushing. It's like a purple pink. Let's see what we get with this. Oh. Okay, so much for that one being my favorite. This one I think has to be my favorite. That is right here. Oh, so pretty. I hope they show up good. And two more. This one's called Feisty. I swear to God, I thought it said Thirsty. I was about to laugh my ass off. Like thirsty. I'm gonna go below the first level that I did. Ooh, oh my god. Orange. So orange, so orange. Oh, yes, right there below my necklace. Oh my orange and orange is my favorite color. And then we got the last one which is Hot Miss. Hot Miss. And this swatch looks like oh, this swatch looks like a pumpkin. That's what I'm talking about. And right here next to the other orange. So, there we go. There's all 12 of them. So, for the first impression, of course, right now I'm wearing the last one that I swatched, which was Hot Mess. So, they all have different formulas. Some of them's consistency coming out of the tube is really hard to work with, with this kind of tubing. It's like um, a hard doe foot flat surface. I don't like that. Um, when I first saw it, I kind of didn't like it, but they have potential. They all have different formulas. Some go on smoother than others. Some go on a little streakier. But I think if I use a lip pencil, that they will apply much better. Or even just my finger, they will apply much better. With this one, this one was one of the really good consistencies. One that I was really depressed with, or really saddened about, was the one that was like Vampire Red reddish bloody whatever you want to call it that one's consistency was kind of liquidy and thick at the same time so i think i need a little bit of mixing going on like i need to get myself a little artist tray or plate so i can mix them better before i apply them but i think they have a lot of potential they are beautiful beautiful colors i usually saw on the video and i would definitely recommend them to you just make sure you have a really good lip brush to go with them because applying with the little doe foot plastic card surface is not easy and it it streaks it out a lot too i think with a lip brush it'll be much easier to apply so i hope you guys enjoyed my lip swatches first impression video and i hope everybody had a great day and i will see you guys in my next video bye